A woman who worked for Rudy Giuliani from 2019 until 2021 filed a lawsuit on Monday in Manhattan Supreme Court saying while Rudy was working as Donald Trump's lawyer, he ordered her to lie to the FBI and perform oral sex while he was on the phone talking to Donald Trump. Noelle Dumphy is also suing Giuliani for sexual assault and harassment. Dumphy charges Giuliani force her to engage in violent sex and show up to video conferences topless. She was also ordered to work at the office wearing tight shorts that were red, white, and blue, as opposed to Rudy's shorts, which were red, white, and soiled. Dumphy claims Giuliani, while drenched in alcohol, would say horrible things about blacks, women, and Jews. In other words, he's a Republican. Well, Donald J. Trump is the former president of the United States, and I talked with him earlier today, and it is not Robert Smigel. I, I can swear on a Bible, this is Donald J. Trump. Thank you. Go Thank ahead, you. take it, take it, take it, David. Thank you. Thank because you. I know, David, how much your people like to take. I, I, I'm sorry, my, my people? You know, David, the Soros people, the Soros worshippers, the mm. Soros backers, mm. all those people. Like the Jews, You're, you mean the Jews. Who said anything about the Jews? You're so gross, David, putting words in my mouth, David. You just, Mr. President, you just said the Soros worshippers? I have no idea what you're talking about, Come David. on, you're being disingenuous. I with all love the Jews, David. I, I love Trump loves the Jews, David. My daughter married a Soros-backed worshipping Soros <laughs> person. David. Soros backed. The terrific people, David. The Soros backed, Soros worshiping Soros people. That they have is, amazing powers, David. That is classic code for they have the amazing Jews. Amazing powers, these people. They can take any judge and turn him into a liberal, David. <laughs> Any judge they want with their amazing Soros-backed powers, Dave. <laughs> you do realize that this is... What? I'm talking about the Soros people. You're talking about the Jews. Did That's I a... mention the Jews? You're the one who can't stop talking <laughs> about the Jews, David. You're the only one in the room yeah, who I... said anything about the Jews. And by the way, I might as well be... An honorary Soros-backed, Soros-worshipping person. Because <laughs> the Soros worshippers in the holy land of is Soros, they love Trump. I'm sorry, what, what, what country? What country are you talking about? The holy land of is Soros. Is Soros. There's is a Soros, the capital Jerusalem. <laughs> It used to be tell, tell Soros, and then I took care of that day. That I said I want the embassy in Jerusalem. <laughs> Jerusalem. Jerusalem, because believe me, the Soros worshippers and is Soros. They can't believe. I'll tell you what they can't believe, and this is so sad, David. Yeah. Did you know that the Soros backed Soros worshippers <laughs> in America, they don't vote for Trump. It's incredible because the holy land of Isseros <laughs> never had a bigger friend than Trump. Ask anyone in Jerusalem. Who's the prime minister of Isseros? Is it's Benjamin Netan Yahusseros. <laughs> He knows where his matzo is. <laughs> Did you say he knows which side his matzo has the horse? He knows where his matzo is cream cheese. <laughs> he knows, David. He knows. So you are the biggest friend of Is Soros, the, the country Is Soros. Okay. Uh, Okay, I, I think you're gaslighting me. You know, you're very charming. I don't and know what you're talking about, David. I, I feel your gas. Now I feel you're charming me. And first, uh, I don't like the Jews. Now I'm a gaslighter. Let me ask you something. I'm asking you to ask me. Okay. 
Why do I love the West Bank so much? Because I do. I love the West Bank. I love the West Bank, David. Okay. Why and do I love the West Bank? Why do you? Go ahead and ask, David. Why okay. do I love the West Bank? Why do you love the Go West Bank? Go ahead. Why Go do ahead you, and ask. Why do you love the West ask Bank? Ask me, David. Why, the, the West Bank, why do you, Donald Trump, love the West Bank? Because it's the only bank in the world I don't owe money to, David. Get it? Hmm. West yes. Bank. Take yes. it, David. That's your joke. Take it. Take the joke, David. Thank you. Thank you. That's charity. That's me providing charity for poor Soros back people that need <laughs> help, David. You're trying okay. to do a comedy. Take the joke, David. Thank you. Take the West Bank joke, David, just like you took the West Bank from the Palestinians. <laughs> See, that's not nice. Take the joke, See? David, take it. You people love, I love you people because you people just love to take. Okay, again, with the, my, take, people, my people, my people. Why would we you said do? anything about the Jews, David. <laughs> you, you just I haven't heard a single word. About the Jews, except you just said my people, the Jews. It's, it's a little uncomfortable. Hey, but let me ask you something. How could Donald Trump? How could Trump possibly hate the Jews? My Lord and Savior, David Jesus Christ, was originally a Soros back, <laughs> Soros worshipping Sorosian. <laughs> He was a Sorosian? He was a Sorosian. And then he realized that the Sorosians <laughs> were donating to Alvin Bragg, David. Alvin Bragg. To the disgusting, corrupt DA. So uh, Alvin so Bragg. The Sorosians were donating to Alvin Bragg. And Jesus said, you know what? I'm going to create my own religion. Hmm. It did, David. Made a fortune, too. <laughs> Jesus huge, made a huge fortune, David. Very smart. But love, David. It was all, a lot of money, all made from love, David. Sweet. That is my exclusive interview with Donald J. Trump, former president of the United States. We talked earlier this morning that is uh, Donald Trump, the 40, I'm being handed a note here. Hang on for one second. See, I'm being told that that is not Donald Trump. I'm being told that it's Robert Smigel. Uh, I don't know who Robert Smigel is. I never met the man. 